So there's many steps to being the gondolier. The first step is gonna be you gotta audition as a singer. They wanna hear what you sound like when you sing and also get to know your personality. Step two is the jump test. You have to be able to swim or you can't really be the gondolier. It's a safety issue, you know, if you go into the water, you gotta be able to get back in the boat, to swim, to help the guests get back safely. And then in the next step, you gotta learn how to actually roll the gondola. It's like riding a bike, but little by little you learn. And the last step is you gotta put all these things together so that you can entertain, make everything safe, make a nice ride, and control the gondola. That's what it's all about. You get to meet people, you get to connect with them, you get to be part of their life, part of their experience. And that's a very special thing. People propose to their, their spouses, their husbands and wives, you know, and you get to be a part of that. They depend on you to sing the romantic music and you're part of this moment in their lives. I think that's a very special thing, you know, and, and that's something that most all the gondoliers, you treasure, you know, you're a part of somebody's life, you're a part of a, an experience and a part of this amazing hotel. For to me, I, those are some of the things I love about it. Stavrona Ada There we go. <laughs> I have been a gondolier at the Venetian for 12 years. The first step to become a gondolier, you must be able to sing in Italiano. Che bella cosa in a giornate sole. That would be a sole mio. The best part of my job is being here and interact with people, sing, and this beautiful uniform. Very proud of it. Today we're going to be doing the jump test from the seat up to the, to the platform, you're gonna jump from the platform on out to the water and do everything you can possible to get in.